Hello everyone, this is Southern Bell Whisper. I hope you all are doing well today. Today, I have a little fall, autumn, Halloween haul for you and a little bit of winter mixed in there. I love hauls, show and tells because you share in the excitement of whatever item somebody bought or got or whatever. I love that feeling of sharing in the excitement but also getting relaxed at the same time. I love, I love hauls. I love show and tells. So today was the first day where I was actually got out and did things. Um, we me and my parents, I took my parents along with me. I said, we need to get out of the house. We need, we need to go do something. We need to go buy Halloween decorations. So <clears throat> we decided to get out of the house for a little bit and go Halloween decoration shopping. But as you know, you go out to get Halloween decorations and come back with a horse. So, um, by the way, you guys, this is, today is like my little last hurrah. It's the 25th. I go to work on the 27th at 8 a.m. So today is like my little last hurrah. So I ate an edible about 30 minutes ago. So if I go on little tangents or get over explaining things or too excited about things, that, that's why. That's why. <laughs> um, so. I just wanted to let you guys know that. So, let's get to the haul, shall we? I'm so excited to show you guys everything. See, there I go, already. I am, I am excited. This is gonna be my first fall Halloween back home. And when I was growing up, we used to go all out for Halloween. We had the zombie, we would take coveralls and like put pillows in him. And, and like sit them in a chair and soon um, I'm going to look through my pictures I know we have pictures of Halloweens that we had here I mean we went all out for Halloween so I am restarting that tradition so my dad had the best idea he said instead of using real pumpkins this year when we get some ceramic pumpkins, that way they'll last forever. And I said, you know what? You're right. So we went into roses. I love roses, you guys. I could spend so much money in roses if I had like millions of dollars. I love roses. But they didn't have much of a fall autumn section, which I found pretty surprising because usually uh, retail stores go all out uh, during, you know, Halloween and Christmas, Thanksgiving. But they didn't have that much of a selection, but they did have these uh, glass pumpkins, ceramic pumpkins. I got orange one, and Dad got orange one. He said, I'll help you. I'll help you. So we got two orange ones and two white ones for the porch. I know I gotta be careful with weathering, of course, but I think it's a smarter idea because, you know, real pumpkins, they rot, and I don't know, I've just been more of a glass ceramic um, decoration gal myself. And I love these little leaves at the top. He's a beautiful pumpkin. this bag there and like I told you guys I got white ones or I got a white one and dad got a white one I forgot what it says he's already put his on the porch you guys I said please wait I said I want to do a video but I was like you know what go ahead why not this one the white ones had writing on them it says thankful and grateful on this one this one's so pretty, you guys. And 
I will say this autumn season how very thankful and grateful I am. Have I been sick? Yes, very sick. But I'm on the mend and I am going to enjoy this fall. If it kills me, I will enjoy this fall. I can't remember the last time I actually got to enjoy the holidays. So I am going to enjoy it to the nth degree. But yeah, I love the white ones. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the orange ones and the pillars on the back on the front porch. And then the white ones in the front where everybody can see them. I want these front and center. not to make too much squeaky noises with uh, my chair here <laughs> this okay this isn't Halloween but this is the lipstick that I'm wearing it was only a dollar I was like I want a purple lipstick and this was the last one like people are all having the same idea you guys because all the all the nail polishes and lipsticks and dark purple have been sold out. This is a matte lipstick. I thought it had a lip gloss on the bottom though. That would have been great because you know with mattes it kind of leaves your uh, lips dry unless you put like a clear lip gloss over it. But for the color I, I love darker lipsticks. So that is the lipstick that I'm wearing. It's only a dollar. Worth every penny to me. This is the nail polish that I'm wearing. I'm trying to not show you guys my nails. Because when I got home, I, my nerves were shot. And uh, I tried to do my nails. And, and I've never been the kind of girl that like colored inside the lines like I was always the girl in school that couldn't col color inside the lines it's a nerve thing like I shake sometimes and they're not perfect but yeah I got they're definitely not perfect uh, but I do love this color it's a dark green I can wear it during Halloween or Christmas that's what I love about green I can celebrate it on Halloween and Christmas, and it's Insta Dry. It's Sally Hansen Insta Dry. My ass. I'm sorry, but that's the problem that happened. Is I've you know blowed on did what I was supposed to do for about five minutes, and they still smudged Insta Dry. Yeah, right. But I do love the color. I do love. The I realized, hold on, let me take the tags off as I show you guys. I realized that we didn't have any oven mitts the other day. I made lasagna and I had bought some of those glass, um, what do you call them? Like the casserole dishes. And I realized we had no oven mitts. I was like, are you? So, these were only a dollar a piece at Dollar General. And it's autumn themed. I think I was too rough with this one though. I think I was supposed to leave this part on there so I can hang it brightly on the cabinetry. It's okay, but I got two of those because you can't be a dollar a piece. You can never have enough of a mitts, you guys, ever. I love plaid, by the way. During autumn, I love plaid. Flannel, especially when a man wears it. Oh my gosh. And guys, I've been getting butterflies in my stomach. My first day back is so close. And I've already checked the schedule, and I know who works. 
and I've been so nervous. Don't worry, be happy, right? I am going to be so happy when I return to work, you guys. So freaking happy. Oh my gosh. Okay. And I was about to leave the Dollar General, and these were on the bottom shelf. But it was buy one, get one 50% off. This, only a dollar for this one to begin with. It's pumpkin latte. Why did I say it like that? It's Emily in Paris, you guys. Pumpkin latte. Latte. Pumpkin latte. I'm sorry. But I haven't even smelled these yet. I just knew Dollar General usually hits. So we'll see. Oh, yes. It smells like pumpkin spice. I don't mind the smell pumpkin spice. And I, well, I obviously don't mind the little Debbie pumpkin spice rolls that come out every year either because I ate like five in one night. I'm sorry. I'm ashamed of myself and I had to get that out. <laughs> I mean, maybe it's with certain things. I don't know. Maybe I just don't understand the hype to begin with. But this smells just like a pumpkin spice latte. There we go, latte. There we go. Gosh. Okay. Uh, yeah. I love candles, especially during this time of year. Alright, can I get the lid on now? I'm not doing this for the sound, you guys. <laughs> I really can't get the lid on. There we go. And then this one was $3. But uh, one of these was half off. And this is maple Belgian waffles. Mm hmm Yeah. It smells just like maple. And so worth the price. So worth it. You could not have enough candles. Like I said, especially this time of year. I forget when I say stuff. And I just repeat myself. I was listening to my last video. I was like, Kelly, you literally just said that. I was talking to myself. I was laying in bed talking to myself, saying, you literally just said that at the beginning of the video. Why are you repeating yourself? Because I literally forget what I say sometimes. Okay, so these are the candles that I got for buy one. Get the other 50% off. Okay. These are... These were only a dollar, you guys, and I think it's supposed to light up, to be honest. I'm going to lift its veil up. I'm sorry. Yes, it does, and I don't even think my dad knows. Oh, my God. He's going to be so excited. These were only a dollar, you guys. Look at that. He does not know it lights up. Oh, my gosh. I cannot wait to show him. It, it lights up. I'm going to turn it off as soon as I show you guys, but he doesn't know. He does not know it lights up. Oh, he's like me. He likes flashy, flashy, pretty things. And it was only a dollar? That is crazy. Let me turn it off because that's another thing that people are buying out the yin-yang is batteries to things like this. Those little like, they look like dimes. Yeah. They were sold out at Roses. So. Good job, Dad. I didn't even realize it lit up. And I don't even think he realized either. Wow. Good job for a dollar. This one. This one says, try me. Does it have a, just like the other one? Yes, it does. Look at that, you guys. Is it supposed to change color or something? Or does it stay on like that? That is perfect. He is going to be thrilled. I wanted to get him. Do you guys remember that um, ghost 
during Halloween, you hung it up in your living room or outside, and it shook. And it did that woo sound from the 90s. I wanted to get him one so bad, but you guys know. So, I couldn't. I just couldn't do it. And he didn't think it was worth it either. This is another one that he got. In which this one is also going to light up. I just have to pull this thing out. See, lights up too. That is good find, Dad. Good find. He's going to be thrilled about that. Alright, let me scoot some of these things over. I might have one of the pumpkins with me. Yes, I do. One of the white ones with me. This one says blessed on it. I am. I am blessed. I am grateful. And I'm thankful. I'm not going to get emotional. All right. <clears throat> this one was only a dollar as well. It was just something we wanted to put on the door because of the next thing I want to show you guys. Ain't nobody going to looking at that. Ain't nobody going to be looking at the front door at the next thing I want to show you guys. But it was only a dollar, and we didn't want the door to go totally bare. And we went for the decorations that are more not like scary or horror or are those big blow up things. We, you know, we had this nice farmhouse and we just wanted to go with elegant and fashionable and just not all over the place, you know. So this is the wreath to go on the door. It's perfect. Perfect. Now, I know some people go all out for Halloween with lights and uh, dummies and ghosts and those big blow-up things in which I would love to have a Harry Potter one, you guys. I'm not going to lie to you. I would love to have a blow-up Harry Potter to put up during Christmas. Seriously. Um, but for the time being, I've gotten, during Halloween, I just like decorating like something you'd see um, in a magazine. You know what? Before I upload this video, I will take a picture of what the house looks like decorated before I upload this video. <gasps> That's a great idea. Don't you guys think so? Because I am so proud. I am so proud of the decorations we got. I just, I can see it in my mind's eye. And I'm like, oh my gosh, our house is going to be the talk of the whole um, town. <laughs> because his sister, my dad's sister, lives right down the road from us. And she's older than him. She's, she's like 75 or 6. And she's having health problems. And every single, every single year, my aunt and her husband go out for autumn. Like, go all out. Their, their house would be in like a good housekeeping magazine. That's how beautiful it is. I said, we, I said, we cannot not decorate this year. I said, don't let her beat you. No, I know how to push his buttons, you guys. I said, don't let her beat you. You're able. I said, all it takes is a few decorations. But this is, I got this at the Dollar General. We've needed a new welcome mat for the longest time. And I'll probably, uh, in December, end up getting a Christmas one, too, because it's so nice to have during this time of year. You know, I, I spotted this last thing. I was like, yeah, yeah. And what's great about it is that I can have it out this month, October, and November. 
the very end of November is usually when I start decorating for Christmas. But ain't it so pretty, you guys? I love the different colored pumpkins, the uh, gray, the, uh, oh my gosh, teal, orange. I love that it doesn't have happy Halloween on it. <laughs> I love that's not orange, even though I love orange. I think it's perfect. I cannot wait to go decorate now, you guys. <laughs> I am going to be, oh gosh, my favorite thing that I got today. I totally forgot until I just looked over and was like, oh my gosh, I forgot. Okay. <gasps> so I went into Roses today and I had to tell myself, I had to say, you're, you're here on a mission, Kelly. You're here to find pants that you need to wear at work. That's another thing, you guys, I've been stressing over. I'm going to have to talk to my boss and get her to agree uh, to me wearing, like, black dress pants that are, like, satiny and don't cling to my skin. You guys give me some good vibes because I know I've already been causing a lot of trouble for them, but I can't wear jeans. I can't wear khakis. I can't wear anything that clings to my skin. So, I do have a pair of black dress pants that I've had forever that I'm gonna wear on my first day back. And then I have some coming from Timu. So, keep my fingers crossed. I mean, they're, okay, they're not jeans, but they're black. I mean, come on. I'm probably stressing over nothing, you guys. I'm probably literally stressing over nothing. I'm sure she'll allow it. Okay, so this was my favorite item. So I had gone into Roses, told myself, I said, Kelly, you're on a mission. You're on a mission. You're on a mission. Don't stop. Don't look. You're on a mission. Pants for work. That's it. And howling stuff. Well, <laughs> Roses knows what it's, it knows what it's doing because they had the coats, winter coats, front and center as soon as you walk through the door and this coat was not only my size but like as soon as I saw it I was like oh my, I, I, I about cried I was like oh my gosh because it's name brand it was $22 and I put it in my buggy I was like okay this is a maybe <laughs> if I spend less on the Halloween decorations this is a maybe but, uh, like I told you guys, I took my parents along with me, and I showed her this coat. I said, it could still be here next check. I'll get it myself. But she wouldn't hear none of it. She got it for me. My mama did. And there is just something so special about this coat. I told her, I said, I've got the one that I wore last year, that I bought last year when I first moved here. That one I'll wear to work, and I'll wear, like, you know, going grocery shopping or something. This coat is for, for, like, church and going out to dinner. Going out. Going out, you know? It's not a coat that you just wear around really willy-nilly. I'm going to hang this coat up on the back of my door and I will not touch it unless I'm going to church. Okay, but anyways, I'm really excited about this coat, you guys. I'm so sorry. But... Now, okay, listen to me, you guys. I usually do not like cream colors like this because I think what if I'm eating something and it gets on it and it's ruined forever well your girl ain't gonna be eating when I got this coat on nope but look look at it you guys and it has a hood yeah it has a hood you guys didn't even realize that oh my gosh it has a hood okay it's called the company is called Big Chill, so it's plus size, it's a 3X, so I know by next year probably it'll be super roomy. Oh gosh, you guys, <laughs> it's so pretty. 
pretty. Thank you, Mama. Thank you so much. She didn't have to do that. Oh, and I love that the buttons snap as you unzip it. I mean, this is a nice, nice, nice dress coat. I just wanted to see the inside. I haven't seen the inside yet. Oh, yeah. Perfect. It's so pretty, you guys. Look at how long it is. And you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the coats that they wear at the end of First Wives Club. That's another movie that I love, if I haven't told you guys. In the end, where they sing, You Don't Own Me, and they put those coats on as they dance. Isn't this the same color as those coats at the end of that movie? I'm pretty sure. So, yeah, that's why I fell in love with that. I was like, Ma, it's just like the coat off of the First Wives Club. And she was like, how much is it? And I didn't even know until I got home that she had gotten, that she had gotten it for me. She used to do that when I was a kid, too. She, I'd see something that I really wanted, and she'd be like, okay, well, we'll see. She loves surprising me. And this is so nice, you guys. And it has a hood. My heart, my heart is pounding. Sorry a treat you guys just feel like getting so emotional I know my mom mama has been worried sick about me since getting sick I know she's been so worried my mom and dad both and I've been really stressed and I've been very agitated and I just want to tell them on this video right now in front of whoever watches my videos how sorry I am for being agitated and having a bad attitude when I'm going through stressful things I can get I, I can still get pretty pretty stressed out and pretty agitated but it's not their fault they have done nothing but brought me into my childhood home and given me anything that I wanted and rooted for me this whole time. They saved my life. And I should be nothing but grateful to them. So I just wanted to say I'm sorry to my parents for for being such a pain in the ass lately. But anyways, you guys, I love you guys so much. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm about to go decorate and then take pictures for you guys so you guys can see what the house looks like decorated but I love you guys and I will talk to you soon